Since Roe v. Wade was overturned, pro-abortion activists have insisted women will die if they can't get a, quote, medically necessary abortion. These fear tactics are flat out lies. Let's set the record straight. Abortion is never medically necessary. When performing an abortion, the only goal is to kill the child. If a pregnant mother is facing a critical health issue that demands intervention, there are always procedures to save the life of the mother that don't include the intentional killing of a child. In these scenarios, we must recognize that sadly, sometimes the babies don't make it. These treatments are not abortions. In many life-threatening situations for the mother, simply delivering the baby early by induction or C-section is the best course of action. The mother's life is saved, and many times the baby does survive. In the case of an ectopic pregnancy, there is unfortunately no way to save the life of the child. In 90% of these cases, the unborn child has already died before doctors realize the pregnancy is ectopic. But this procedure is not an abortion. In these cases, removing the embryo is absolutely necessary to save the life of the mother. Without treatment, both mother and child die. But again, this is not an abortion because it doesn't stop a beating heart. Now you have the facts. Abortion is never medically necessary. Abortion is never justified. For more information, please visit fpiw.org.